Roblox is in danger. People are angry at Roblox right now. Roblox is in huge trouble, but more insane news today. Our first deal starts Roblox being in danger, or like Roblox not being safe. Let me break down what's going on. So as I'm sure we're all aware, a few years ago, the infamous Roblox Crossroads incident happened, which if you aren't aware of somehow, basically what happened was that people somehow found ways to delete your account just by making you join a game. And they would use some trick to make you type some like insane statement. And ever since the situation, Roblox has said that they fixed this and it's died down a lot, obviously. But over the past few months, there have been a few instances of this popping up. And recently, there's been so much more and it seems to be getting way worse. So just recently, I saw this person saying, I got fake banned for joining a link. Someone help me. What do I do? And in the screenshot, it says their account was fully deleted. And to be honest, I don't know what it says because it's in Spanish, but what the message is that they said is super bad. And the statement that like the game forced him to say is obviously going to get him banned. And as we can see, people are kind of switching up how, you know, they approach this kind of crossroads method. Before, people would just make the games look kind of like normal games and then promote them and stuff to get to people to join it but now what people are doing is that they're just linking it to people on discord saying like oh it's just like a normal game and then right when they click on it and join it it absolutely just destroys your account and gets them banned which are actually pretty insane because not only is it insane just in the first place that your account can get deleted this quickly but it's also insane because as i mentioned at the start roblox said that they fix this and it shouldn't be possible anymore and there was a period where like people switched up the method to do it but now it seems like the main method is back there's no like loophole around it people are just using the same old method now ever since this tweet and a lot of people played the game it has been content deleted but this game in particular for example just one of them has like 3,000 visits which means you know this person banned like 3,000 accounts easily and it's not only just this one there's been more and more popping up so right now rolls is not safe at all and if anyone likes you a game like no matter what even if the game seems fine don't join it and only stick to like the top page games because this issue seems to be getting worse right now especially because i've seen more and more popping up and overall be very careful with what games you play because there's all these flying around right now and your account could get deleted and anyways with that being said let's move to your next to where people being angry at roblox so recently rolls added a christmas theme to the robux page which is actually pretty cool because rolls hasn't added like a christmas theme or anything like that in years so people are very excited to see this however for a few reasons people are actually angry at rolls for this so number one a lot of people are angry just in the first place because if you go to check your robux page right now a lot of you guys probably don't have this and for some reason rolls can add it to like everyone's account and it's like very rare and only like a few people have it so i don't know how that works but besides that the main kind of drama scene with this is that everyone's pretty angry and saying this is kind of depressing from roblox because they added a holiday and christmas theme for the first time in years but they only added it to the robux page because they don't actually care about anything else they just want to get money green like has summed it up perfectly saying rolls adding a holiday theme to the site for the first time in 10 years but making it only on the robux page is so sad and i mean yeah in general if you think about it like that that is pretty depressing from roblox and there's been a bunch of tweets about this of people being like oh the, th the theme and stuff is pretty cool but the fact that it's only on the robux page is kind of depressing and in general people are just kind of angry because rolls keeps doing stuff like this and it just shows like how money hungry the company's gotten recently and well speaking of that let's get into our next story which is kind of related being that rolls is dying so recently rolls have been kind of dying and let me kind of break down what's going on so quick i've made a video on this and a bunch of people have been talking about this recently where roblox's competition and like roblox like main competitors are starting to dominate them for example look at this tweet as you can see for years roblox dominated games like fortnite and they were always like more popular than fortnite but recently, Fortnite went all the way up and Roblox is actually going down. And in general, when you compare Roblox to its competitors, they're actually starting to fall now. And while it's pretty apparent why this is happening, if we look at games like Fortnite, Fortnite is a very community oriented game. They communicate with their players, they try adding what players want, and in general, Fortnite's at like a high point right now, just in general with all the new stuff going on. And Fortnite even has a feature where people can make an upload game just like Roblox now. But when that launched initially, Roblox was still doing better. But now that Fortnite has started adding more stuff and it's just like an overall, you know, they're good with interacting with their players and fixing stuff and Rolls is doing the opposite, Fortnite is going up and Rolls are going down. And this kind of shows that the direction Rolls has been going for the past few years is just going to like lead to their demise. Ever since the stock launch, they completely distanced themselves from the community and they've been completely ignoring their players and stuff and now it's starting to backfire on them because a lot of people are leaving to play other games and stuff and in general people think Rolls is dying right now. Obviously the game is never going to officially just fully die out it's one of the biggest games in the world but as we can see it's starting to lose it to their competitors which like i said it's completely their fault and overall if we look at robles and fortnite i've seen a lot of people saying this recently where if you guys aren't aware fortnite recently added like or i think they removed it but recently they did add like an og version of their game where people can play like the og version of fortnite and that brought back like the most players they ever had 
And with that, a lot of people are saying that if Rolls goes back to their old way of adding egg hunts and interacting with their players again, Robles will benefit so much from it. And we've literally seen proof from other games. However, they just never do it. And while now, because of everything going on and everything Rolls have been doing, they're starting to fail against their competitors, which is very interesting to see. And anyways, with that being said, let's get to our next story of a quick one, but a pretty interesting one being that Robles has been doing a bunch of sales recently. Lucas here tweeted out saying, I think Rolls should really consider adding back the recently updated tab in the catalog. I randomly found this ad that is now an offer. With no other posts about this, yeah, it was updated last 29 days ago. It's currently 50% off at no official analysis bit. So yeah, so ever since Rolls removed like the recently updated and, and added tab, it's been hard to keep track of items. And